Okay guys, you're gonna have to excuse the road noise and the noise back here. So what we're looking at right here is the is the diamond antenna BB7. I have it on the barbed wire fence. And what you're seeing right here is a mediocre antenna at best. And it goes on up there, but really and truly, the magic happens in here. It's supposed to be relatively resonant on like every band. It does okay, you have to use a tuner with it, but this is very a very capacitive antenna. What that is, is it's basically just a big dummy load with a whip on it. It works mediocre at best. Now we're gonna head in the shop and actually see what's going on. So here's the PSK report on 15 meters with the, with the diamond antenna. This is the 17 meter PSK report, doing okay. Uh, this is the zoomed out 20 meter report, and this is the zoomed in 20 meter report. All these tests were done at about 10 watts. Here's the 10 meter report, so you can see that the antenna does marginally okay, but it's really not the best. I think this antenna meets specific needs, like what Diamond created it for. It's made for people in an HOA. It's made for people who want a low profile, low footprint antenna that does an okay and good job at what it's doing. It's about 17 feet tall, but it does collapse down. I have a tripod that this can be mounted to for field use, but right now the bob wire fence does just fine. I recommend this antenna if you're just trying to make FT8 contacts or single sideband contacts. You're not going to do any crazy DX. You're not going to win any contests, but this does serve a purpose. 73, guys.